Hello, it's Jimmy again, and I'm going to show you today Quicker's Bibtech Sniffer. It's the fastest way that you can get all the metadata for your PDFs up to date and 100% accurate with very little work. Let's get going. I'm going down to my empty guest library just because I don't work with my current PhD library. Open that up. I'm going to drag in a whole lot of PDFs that I've collected. And what it will do is OCR those and replace the automatic file names with the, t the largest text it finds on the front page of each of those PDFs, which is generally the title. If it gets it wrong, we'll sort that out later. So once it's got all the text there, you can fire up the BibTeX sniffer. I'll fire that up, let me just move it into range here. And what you'll see is on the top left hand corner is the PDF that we're currently looking for the BibTeX for. In the top right is the space to put the BibTeX. And down here is a browser for you to help find that BibTeX. What Quicker automatically does is it takes the title it found, searches Google Scholar for that, and most of the time it's going to get it right. And all you have to do is import into BibTeX and you'll notice it associates that record with this PDF and you can move on to the next paper. Again, you can see it's got towards it by Jingu Kim. It's correct. Import into BibTeX and you're ready to move on. If you're tired of pressing that import into BibTeX button, turn on the wizard. This saves a lot of time. Right, I've turned that on. Now when I press next, it automatically will search for the document I have here automatically find the BibTeX to do with it and paste it in there. So all you really need to do is check the title, check the authors, and hit next. There we go. Check the title, Discovery Relevance Semantic, uh, Scientific Literature by Balika. There it is in the BibTeX, next. And literally finding all your uh, BibTeX records can be extremely quick. Notice here, it's not got the correct um, title here. If I se just select that title, It'll then research for that, and there it is, Karen Spark Jones, next. And that is basically what the, the BibTeX wizard does for you. Another thing I forgot to mention is if you don't have any BibTeX or a PDF, just put a little hash in that box, and it won't keep asking you each time what the, what, what the BibTeX is for that missing PDF. Hope you like that. I'll chat to you soon. Cheers.